the first race, first half of the Daily Double. Win, play, show, and exact a wagering also on this top line stakes for fillies and mares on the trot, age three and up. Anthony Morgan drives the one. That's the only change in either half of the Daily Double. Let's meet the starters for the first. Number one, Storbot, owned by Phil Langley of Frankfort, Illinois, trained by Jim Eaton. The driver will be Tony Morgan. Number two, Stormy's Only Gal is owned by Philip Cotton of Fairfield and by Clara Vandekar of nearby New Berlin, trained by Phil Cotton, Andy Miller in the bike. Mama Mac, number three, is owned and driven by Anna Ruman of Staunton. James Ruhotsky is the trainer. Number four is Do Re Mi, owned by Joie de V Farm, of Jobstown, New Jersey. Per Erickson trains, Dave McGee drives. Number five, Double Flirt, owned by C.D. and Rick Huffman of Sigourney, Iowa, trained and driven by Michael Cox. Number six, Angela Lane, owned by Brittany Farms of Versailles, Kentucky by Jerry and Rosalie Silva of Belmore, New York, trained by Ron Gerfine, Mike LaChance, the driver. And here's number seven, Heather Valley, owned by the Duncan Foundry and Machine Works Incorporated of Alton, Illinois, trained by John Cisna. Mike Rogers is in the bike. They're at the post, the gates rolling for the first race of the day. The top line stakes for trotting fillies and mares, age three and up. The top line has been coming here for many, many years. Illinois State Fair was a charter member of this circuit, which is open to the world, not restricted to just Illinois breads. Here they come. They're off and trotting. There goes Angela Lane out for the early lead. Do Re Mi gets away in second. Stormy's only gal comes out trotting third. Then Mama Mac. Storebots toward the inside. Double flirt toward the center of the racetrack. Heather Valley gets away in last as they head on to the first turn. Angela Lane moves up on the outside. Gets the lead clear by a length from Do Re Mi, who's second by three. Then Stormy's only gal. Storebots toward the inside. Double flirt, Mama Mac and Heather Valley. Trotting by the quarter mile mark, they were there in 29 seconds. Angela Lane leads it by a length to Do Re Mi, Stormy's only gal. Gap of two more to Store Bots, Double Flirt, Mama Mac, and Heather Valley. Field goes single file for the move up the back stretch. They're being led by Angela Lane. Angela Lane by a length. Do Re Mi goes second and gets a good trip. Stormy's only gal is in good position as well. Three lengths off the leader in third. Gap of two to Store Bots, who's racing in the fourth position as they move by the half mile mark. Double flirt, Mama Mac and, and uh, Heather Valley complete the field. 58 and four was the time for the half. To the far turn, they're all chasing Angela Lane. Do Re Mi just continues to stalk her in second. Stormy's only gal still waiting to make her move in third. Then store bots, double flirt, Mama Mac and Heather Valley. Midway on the last turn, no one moving among the top four. So Angela Lane continues to show the way by a length and a half. It is still Do Re Mi in second. Stormy's only gal will need to move soon. She's four lengths off the lead in third. Three quarters, 128 and four. Angela Lane continues to pick up the tempo off the turn, leading Do Re Mi, then Stormy's only gal. Moving by the eighth pole, it is still Angela Lane. Now by three lengths all of a sudden to Do Re Mi. Stormy's only gal, a distant third. Here's Do Re Mi now closing the gap. And finally, Do Re Mi kicks on for home. Do Re Mi. Me gets up by five lengths on the line. Angela Lane, second Stormy's only gal, was far back in third, 156 and four. Time for the mile. Fourth winner of the week, our 19th winning favorite overall of the week, driver Dave McGee with Do Re Me. 
owned by Schwa de V Farm of Johnstown, New Jersey. Per Erickson is the trainer. The winner bred by Lindy Farms of Connecticut in partnership with others. This filly, a three-year-old by Pine Chip, 156 and four, knocking nearly a full second off her prior lifetime record. It's official, and the 4-6 exacta returns $7.40.